soldiers, Marines, airmen, and sailors constantly go out in armored tactical vehicles like these. They can handle a lot of the rugged terrain and harsh conditions of Afghanistan, including dirt, wind, and even explosions. Still, they need a tune-up now and then to keep going. That's where this gentle giant Airman Tracy Branch from Norfolk, Virginia comes in. Well, we fix all the tactical vehicles on base, like all the Humvees, MATVs, uh, the Cougars, and the uh, Max Pros. Branch works in the tactical vehicle maintenance shop at Bagram Airfield. Sometimes when these vehicles need some work from his able hands, it's just for an easy fix, like this seat belt. Other times, he says it's clear the vehicle went through hell and back. I like figuring out the problem and just getting it done, getting it working again. A lot of stuff that come in here is like really, really messed up. Well, we get it out pretty quick. One of the Cougars got blown up, couldn't really fix it. But we had to do like a battle damage estimate and take all the parts off and just get it out. Regardless of how severe the damage is, Branch has spent his two years in the Air Force trying to get vehicles like these back in the fight. I feel proud like to know that what I do will affect their safety and how the mission is carried out. It's really important. Air Force Staff Sergeant Jessica King, Bagram Airfield, Afghanistan.